investigation into the killing of Jamal Khashoggi, a Washington Post columnist, the UN's investigator Agnes Kalmar published her report. Kalmar emphasized that the state of Saudi Arabia was responsible for the execution of Khashoggi. Kalmar also pointed the finger at Mohammed bin Salman, the crown prince, who had denied any involvement. The focus has been on who has ordered the killing. I do not have evidence regarding who has ordered the killing. What I do have is evidence suggesting that the responsibilities of high-level officials may be engaged and therefore is requiring further investigation, in particular of the Crown Prince for a variety of reasons. The first one is that the people directly implicated in the murder reported to him. Kalmar also called for sanctions against the Crown Prince as well. Turkish officials welcomed the report. Turkish Foreign Minister Mevlüt Çavuşoğlu tweeted that he strongly endorsed Kalamard's recommendations to hold those responsible accountable. Ankara had carried out a thorough investigation following the murder of Khashoggi and had claimed to have a recording of the moment he had been killed. The proposal was rejected by Saudi Arabia, where 11 suspects are on trial. Adel al Jubair, Saudi Arabia's Minister of State for Foreign Affairs, dismissed the UN report, stating that it contained contradictions and baseless allegations. In November, Saudi prosecutors had stated that Khashoggi had in fact been killed inside the consulate, that his body had been dismembered and disposed of. However, they claimed it was the result of a rogue operation. Amikhar Badri for CGTN in Istanbul.